Hi everyone, Unboxingalism here and welcome back to my channel. In this quick video, I share two ways on how you can connect your brand new Magic Trackpad with your M1 Mac Mini. Let's start it. First you need to turn it on, so please make sure on its side the switch is toggle to green. It is important to mention that if you have bought a used Magic Trackpad, maybe you need to charge it before the connection process. Now you can see my M1 Mac Mini screen. Next, go to the System Preferences, then Bluetooth. Maybe you need to switch the toggle on and off more than once to see it on this list. Now select the Connect button. That's it, we are done with the connection process. Before I show you the second way of connecting it, I would like to give you a bonus tip. If you would like to give a unique name to your trackpad, right click on it, then select the rename and you can customize its name. If you are enjoying the video so far, just take a second and click on the subscribe button, it really does help growing my channel. Thank you. Anyways, you can disconnect and remove your magic trackpad here as well. Now it's time to show you the second way to connect your trackpad with your Mac. First you need a lightning cable. Because the Mac has a USB-C and a USB-A port, both cable types will work fine. I have unpaired my Magic Trackpad from my Mac Mini, so it does not show up on the device list. I will plug the USB-C to my Mac and the Lightning to the trackpad. As you can see it connected automatically and the Mac shows this connected animation as feedback. If for some reason you can't connect the Magic Trackpad with your Mac, please try the followings. Maybe you need to charge the battery. Check if the switch is on on your Magic Trackpad. Check if Bluetooth connection is turned on on your Mac as well. Restarting your Mac Mini may solve the connection issue. Try to use a different USB-C or USB-A cable. These were the most common issues you might encounter. That's all I wanted to say on how you can connect your Magic Trackpad with your brand new M1 Mac Mini. I hope this short video helped you out and you learned something useful. If you did, please consider giving me a thumbs up and subscribing to my channel. That would be really appreciated and would help my channel grow. Thank you and see you in the next one.